Hi friends, it's Missy L, and we are here for some fun nature-based activities. This week we are talking about nature and the sticks from the trees and everything fun outside for the Jewish holiday of Sukkot that celebrates the harvest time and celebrates embracing the nature that surrounds us. So I have some fun um, activities for us to do this week that involve going outside and going on a nature hunt and taking a bucket, filling it up with stuff and bringing it home for the activity. So I think one of my favorites, they're all kind of my favorite this week, was our name nature collage. So Preston didn't want to do his name. He did his initials and I wrote them out in bubble letters for him. And then he went and found some leaves and sticks. He decided to glue them on. You can also kind of do it as a puzzle and just leave it and have them place and place different items. You can use sticks and rocks and leaves and flowers, anything you find outside in your nature walk or in your backyard. Um, and then if you want to glue them on, then you have a cool design of your name made out of nature. And he is PLL for Preston Levi Lawrence. So he now has his own little monogram of nature. So another activity is building with sticks. So I happen to have a bunch of popsicle sticks in our house, but you can also just collect sticks from outside. So there's two ways you can do this. You can whoops, take sticks and just stack them on top of each other and see what kind of creation you can build together if you want. Now, um, and kind of like blocks or Lincoln logs, and you can do that too. Preston wanted to glue his so it would become a full structure. So he started gluing his sticks together to create a structure and he wanted to put it on a piece of paper. So he glued it on the paper so that way he had um, a foundation for his building. Then if you wanted to, you could take sticks and lace them through. You could stack them on top and build them up. You can take them out and add them back on again. Okay, so we have some fun stick building. I love using sticks. Again, you can use popsicle sticks. You can use chopsticks. You can use any sticks you find outside. It's just a different medium to build with, and it's just something kind of interesting and fun to see what you can create. And the glue actually helps you really get a lot of height and create a 3D design. Okay, so we had our name, uh, name collages, we had our stick building, and now it is time for our nature xylophone. So I happen to have, I'm actually going to use our leaf or our stick bouquet from our crafts this week. Also, I happen to have some glass mason jars and plastic, and I went on a little nature walk myself. So I have my stick bouquet that we made. And I found some little rocks that I put in my little mason jar. And I found some really big rocks I put in my big mason jar. And then you can make music with these. And they make different sounds depending on the size of the jar and what you put inside of it. You can fill it up with some sticks. You can use a stick, a popsicle stick. To make music, you can take one of your decorated sticks. You can even have a rock that you use very gently. Tap, tap, tap. And make different music and sound with our nature xylophone. So, so many fun things. You guys know that I love going outside and exploring in nature, and I love bringing the nature home and making something fun with it. So I thought that this xylophone, this nature xylophone was really fun. I know the sun is shining really bright, so it's a little bit harder to see it right now, but I hope you have a fun week, and I'm excited to see you soon and do all of our nature activities together. Bye, everybody.